Hey guys, welcome back to Geek News. I am your host, I am Adam, and today we've got some more Masters of the Universe, so very good morning to all you guys. And of course, it is a new limited edition of 1-6 Mondo He-Man from Mondo. So let's go ahead and check a quick read-up, and of course, we will check all the images as usual. So let's see what we got going on here. So shown below is a look of the upcoming limited edition 1-6 Mondo He-Man figure from Mondo. It will be available only at the Mondo official site as an exclusive 24 hour timed edition for $260. I assume they assume that it's probably US currency. That's what I'm going to assume right at the moment. So the pre-order goes live on June 21st, 2022 and the figure is expected to ship February 2023 to most worldwide locations. So let's go ahead and check out some of these images going on here and see what we get. So we, it showcases a lot of stuff that we got going, but we'll see what it is when we look at the photos. So here's our first one, and of course he's in the style of Thunder Punch He-Man. Talk about some crazy detail going on here with some crazy articulation. We even got the caps going on here in the shield going on there, so it looks really nice. You guys can kind of see that there. Looks really nice absolutely like this look at that sword it looks like it's half fire sword going on there so that's pretty cool we've got uh, the crest actually looks really good it even has like all that little detail like that mechanical detail that you would see from the vintage toy so it looks really good I assume I don't know if this is furry cloth or if this is just a molded sculpt if this is just a molded sculpt this is a really good freaking detail I will say that right off the bat looks really good there let's go ahead and let's move on so you're gonna get a couple forms of course we've got the regular he-man going on here so with regular harness so we got that as well and it looks like he is sporting the knife in the boot so we're getting that as well so that's cool we got the power sword that's traditional so we got that as well so that looks really good there cool so we've got this as well this more of looks like I can't remember what this one is from but this looks like almost like anti attorney he-man or something going on but it's pretty cool here this is a lot different I'm unfamiliar with the where this is actually from originally but it looks pretty good you guys can let me know though it's pretty cool there and of course there is our he-man traditionally I have the power of course he's got the nice wavy hair and I think they did a fairly good job with the face golf I'd be fairly overall happy with that I think it looks pretty good and there he is with our battle armor he-man going on there so that looks really good so we're gonna have that removable so it looks like he's gonna have this piece of uh, gauntlet as well so it looks good there and cool so we got some oh we got the battle damage removable crests so that's really cool so you're gonna be able to interchange those so that looks really good there you guys get a good look going on there looks pretty cool let's move on and see what else we got going on here and so there's another shot of the thunder punch he-man with a really good shot of that sword so it's translucent plastic so it looks really great I like that. I would like to get a power sword like that in the Masterverse or the Origins line with the translucent plastic. Bring that. Give us, give us that, Mattel. That's really cool. Hopefully they'll do something like that, but they'll probably just give us the red sword when the Origins Thunder Punch He-Man comes out. That's my guess. And wow, so okay, here we go. We got lots of accessories. So of course we got the Thunder Punch shield with the of course, I don't assume these are going to be real caps, but they're going to represent the real caps, so that's pretty cool, more than likely. We got some, we got a pointing hand, we got some, well, looks like we got some aloft hands, actually, which is really good. We got the harness for the Thunder Punch He-Man, we got the gauntlets for Thunder Punch He-Man, we got a Thunder Punch, really cool looking um, lightning effect for the sword. So you guys can kind of see that there, it looks really good. It's actually really nice there pretty cool uh, we've got that removable knife that you have in the poop and for the boots there so it looks pretty good we've got another shield going on here so it looks pretty cool there we got a couple extra head sculpts so we've got the classic so he's even gonna come with the classic head sculpt so that's really cool if you don't want to go with this more modern take even though the modern one looks really good 
I think that they did justice with it. It looks really good for He-Man. Uh, they got the battle armor and, of course, removable broken chest piece there. Or crest, I should say. And, of course, the battle axe and the traditional sword. So you get lots of accessories going on there. So it looks really good overall. Pretty impressive. And, yeah, so there you are. You're getting these three good looks there. Now, what about the other one that we seen earlier in the images? Okay. So, there's our Thunder Punch He-Man. So, it's going to go on his fist. Okay, I thought this was going to be an effect for the sword. But, it's actually an effect for the fist itself. So, that's pretty cool. Nice little pose going on there. So, you're going to have some really nice articulation here with He-Man. And there he is with Duncan, so it looks pretty good there. Duncan looks kind of off in the face to me. I don't know. Kind of got like that shaved side head going on there. Looks like he's giving him the battle armor. So that's cool. Duncan would have created the battle armor, right? So it looks pretty cool there. And of course our overall image of Thunder Punch He-Man here. Really nice image going on there. So let's see, we got two more to look at. Wow, okay, cool. So it looks good. Some nice poses going on there with the battle armor human. And there he is. Wow, that is a frigging tall figure. That's really good. For something that's really articulated and detailed, it's really big. But that would look really cool on your shelf. And it even looks like the boots are furry as well. Or are they sculpted? Um, I can't really tell. But either way, it looks freaking good. I almost want to have it to be the furry kind, but you might like the sculpted more. We'll have to just wait and see what's going on with it. So there you have it, guys. There is our new He-Man that's coming here from Mondo. So be ready to have him for $260. So he's going to drop June 21st only for 24 hours. I expect he will probably sell out a lot faster than that depending on how many is available. But there you have it, folks. And we will catch you guys on the next one. So you guys have a good one. Take care now. Have a good one. And till next time.